From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Emily Luxon with your news headlines. Evacuations and water rescues have been underway throughout the day as heavy rain falls in Middle Tennessee. In Rutherford County, the Sheriff's Office is telling people to stay off the roads. The Kimbrough Woods subdivision in Murfreesboro flooded this morning. At one point, there was only one way in and out for residents. Several people attempted to drive through the water but got stuck. Again, officials say never try to drive through standing water on a road. The Red Cross has opened an emergency shelter in Coffee County for those affected by the flood. It's set up at College Street Elementary. That's at 405 College Street in Manchester. Call police if you need assistance at 931-728-2991. The areas around our cities, rivers and lakes are overflowing, and that includes the marina near Nashville Shores in Hermitage. Mayor David Briley met with officials at the city's emergency operations center this afternoon about the flooding. The center has been partially activated as officials monitor flooding in the area, and the American Red Cross has set up a shelter at McGavick High School for people impacted by the storms. Now the concerns switch to the possibility of severe weather. Here's the latest for meteorologist Henry Rothenberg. Emily, as we continue through the nighttime hours, that severe threat with us until really after midnight, and then we'll start to see everything sliding out. Heading into your Sunday morning, we're going to have a little bit of a fog for some locations, mainly those low-lying areas. Lots of sunshine, though, by the afternoon, so there's something to look forward to. As the rain tapers off, 46 degrees, breezy, a southwest wind at 15 to 20. Here's that seven-day planner, ah, 50s and sunshine. Doesn't that look fantastic? It'll be with us through Tuesday. Rain chances back Wednesday into next weekend.